Hello my silent shrooms, hijinks here. I cover pop news, games, and lit reviews. Comment, like, and subscribe to keep the channel growing. Activist, IGN's France, Editor-in-Chief, E1, attacks Stellar Blade like it's a blood frenzy shark, implying the game kills women. What does that even mean? Iwan wrote, yes, no problem, go tell that to the women who are killed, denigrated, or who commit suicide because they cannot live up to the fictional standards expected by men. Except there's one big fact in the way. The game uses 3D body scanning technology, and the model of Eve was based on a real live model. You can see her on the left of the screen. Iwan continued, the problem is not the sexy design itself, except that it sucks compared to others, but hey, that doesn't matter. But the percentage of males who will only want this type of fictional body in reality... I'll state it again. <laughs> the body of Eve is based on a real world model who eats, sleeps, and breathes. Ewan goes on. Obviously, we understand this does not shock people who think that women are objects who must obey and be beaten. This design makes us sigh and roll our eyes, and we laugh at anyone who needs it, man or woman, but that is it. What the fuck is Ewan talking about? Should we call a mental institution for them? And who is hiring these ill people into positions of power? At the very least, IGN denounced this and apologizes to the Shift Up Corporation. As you may recognize these characters, to the right we have Benetta, and to the left we have To Be from Near Automata. There were no apologies when before IGN France's own Ben Osola criticized the designers of Eve, saying, And the result is not really a success. It's not new, and other games have chosen to highlight the strengths of their female characters. But where a Bayonetta stands out with an iconic character designs, or a 2B from near Automata inspires an entire generation of cosplayers, Eve from Stellar Blade is just bland. A doll sexualized by someone who would think has never seen a woman, which is especially funny because Eve is based on a real-life woman. Who are these twits and how do they get positions of power? Gamers don't feed the crazy activist trolls if you disagree with them. Remember, vote with your wallet. Call out any insane behavior before it comes normalized. Don't forget to flick the like to keep the channel up and running.